Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you the map box system I've been using for the past year now. It's a combination of the small rig lightweight map box and the Freewell Magnetic ND system. I found it very effective running both the Freewell system on the small rig mini map box because I'm able to not only have the sun protection that the map box provides, I could pop in and out magnetic filters to easily change the strengths on the fly and it's really not that much more time than using a variable ND and you don't get the ugly color cast in the sky where some parts of the image are darker and lighter from the different strengths of ND. And what's really awesome is you can stack the filters to a certain extent. If you really wanted to, you could get a 4x5-6 filter and put it in front as well with either diffusion or different strengths of ND. I opted not to use the 4x5-6 filters as they're very expensive and I just haven't gotten into that system yet. The Freewell system comes with different filter strengths that you could purchase. I bought the kit, so I'm able to have two, four, and six stops of fixed ND that I can change on the fly or stack to get a darker image to be able to get the correct exposure for my shots. The small rig mini map box comes with adapter rings with screw on filters. So I was able to connect the Freewell magnetic filter onto that and then be able to then quickly swap solid ND filters that you can magnetically stack or use different strengths to hot swap the strengths on and off. As you can see, if I darken the image, I could just quickly pull it off and swap filters and change the different strengths that I have to be able to adjust my exposure on the fly. As you can tell, this is way too dark. And then I just can pop it off and have the correct exposure. I have one on right now. And now you can see it's way too bright. This is a 0.6, which is a two stops of diffusion. I just pop it on to be able to get the correct exposure that I lit the scene for. So it's very versatile to have these magnetic filters that you can just hot swap very easily. And that combined with the mini Mac box with the screw on threads makes it super versatile because not only can you add diffusion on the front and then put the magnetic ring on that, and which is what I'm doing currently. I have a Tiffin diffusion on at the moment. You can quickly change the exposure with the magnetic system without having to fuss with the color cast that variable NDs have. So it's very versatile to be able to just quickly hot swap your NDs. I find that it's one of my favorite systems so far. I've seen a lot of different systems online. It's not that time consuming to be able to just swap the magnetic filter. As convenient as variable NDs are, the color cast is really what strayed me away from those. Purchasing 4x5-6 filters can get really expensive. This Freewell system, it being circular design, way less glass, a lot cheaper than 4x5-6 filters. It's quick, efficient, like they don't fall, the magnets are pretty strong. You're able to stack multiple filters without seeing too much vignetting. I'm currently using a 24 millimeter. I haven't tried it on a 16 millimeter and stacking filters because I don't own that lens. As of right now with most focal lengths, any longer focal lengths, you'll be totally fine stacking filters as long as like you watch the uh, reflections and glares from light, but that's why you have the map box. One thing I would add to the system is making little tabs to say what strength ND you have on depending on their time constraints. It's super efficient to know on the side of the map box what ND filter you have or diffusion filter you have by having these Velcro tabs that you could put on the side. This is something they do in cinema and like film and TV. They always have different strengths of ND that they might put in and they'll put these little tabs on the side to show the ACs and the camera team what ND is in so they always make it a habit to swap them as they put NDs in. I took that little uh, tip from working on set to my YouTube setup because now I can know what strength ND I have at the side just by a glance without having to look at the front of the filter to know what ND I have in or what diffusion I have in. I just made a stencil and I attached some Velcro to the side and then I made little tabs, different strengths of ND written on them and I could just pop them in and out. It's super efficient to have just a moment's glance. You can see what ND strength you have in. I hope you guys enjoyed. This was my mini map box setup with the Freewell magnetic system. I think it's a very versatile and budget system if you're just getting into buying NDs, especially solid NDs. Buying four by five, six filters can get really expensive. This, I bought the kit that came with different strengths, a polarizer, a little diffusion, 
and it's really convenient to be able to just hot swap them in and out with magnets. It's super strong as well. I've never had one fall. It can be a little hard to pull apart if you have them all stacked together, but I usually don't run that many NDs stacked on top of each other. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Chris. Comment down below what you think of this system. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and thank you.